So uh, what are you proposing here? Well, we're proposing to bring forward a private member's bill in the Assembly to change the definition of a victim so that uh, a perpetrator who was involved in acts of terrorism is no longer equated uh, with uh, a victim. Sinn Féin will oppose this. Why are you doing this? Well, because we feel the current definition is fundamentally flawed. Um, there can be no moral equivalence between um, a perpetrator, a terrorist, um, and uh, an innocent victim. That's absolutely clear. Um, and when you consider the uh, outcry that there was after the proposal by Eames Bradley to make a recognition payment to uh, the current, uh, uh, currently defined victims, including uh, terrorists, uh, then we feel this is something that needs to be addressed. We've sought to address it in the past by amending legislation. That wasn't possible, so now we're bringing forward this private member's bill uh, to do just that. Won't Sinn Féin be able to block this in the Assembly? Um, Sinn Féin would need a petition of concern signed by 30 MLAs uh, to block the legislation. At the moment they have 27 MLAs, so they're going to have to get the support of other parties to block this. Now, we are hopeful that a consensus can be uh, established uh, in the Assembly amongst the other parties uh, for a definition that makes clear there is no moral equivalence between a perpetrator and a victim. So it puts the SDLP in a very strong position then? Well, uh, the SDLP have already made clear, uh, and indeed as recently as yesterday in the debate on Libya, that they do not see a moral equivalence between a perpetrator and a victim, um, and uh, therefore we want to explore with them and the other parties how we can define a victim in a way that makes clear that someone who was engaged in an act of terrorism is not treated as a victim. Now, there are obviously some grey areas. How are you going to address those? Well, one of the reasons we're uh, putting our proposal out to consultation is to seek the views of individuals and indeed groups um, on uh, those particular uh, issues. Um, and people can go online to our website, they can uh, read about the issues and give us their response, or they can write to me about it. Um, and uh, we want to have a, an open debate about these uh, matters. We recognise the sensitivities of all of this. But when you boil it all down, it comes down to this issue. Uh, can there be a moral equivalence between a perpetrator, a terrorist, and their victim? In our view, there can't. That's why we want to change the legislation.